Hello everyone, welcome back to Pandu Vlogs. It's been so long, right? Uh, we didn't, uh, I didn't upload any video. So yeah, I know guys. So this is, you know when? This is the December of 2021. But I'm, uh, maybe I don't know whether I will be uploading in December or in the January. Because it's almost in the mid of December. So, what are we doing today? Today, we are actually traveling to Chitragut Waterfalls. Uh, uh, it's in Jagdalpur, Chhattisgarh. No, uh, this is the same expression I had when I first heard this place, you know, Jagdalpur, Chhattisgarh, Chitragut waterfalls, literally, I don't know any one of this, I mean, Chhattisgarh, I know, you guys know, right, I used to uh, ride in this group called uh, MIB, Men in Black Riders, so today actually the ride is with them, uh, we have like uh, nine riders totally, so we got two tigers, one 800 uh, X, another one is Triumph uh, Tiger 900 and then uh, we have two Apache Ara 310s two rockets, Triumph rockets and then one Himalayan riding with us ok guys, so after the breakfast uh, we have uh, you know, filled the petrol in uh, tank as well now we are going to enter uh, uh, Badrachalam, we crossed Badrachalam and I think the roads are going to get a little scenic so fasten your seat belts okay we're not in the car right so put your helmets on and then uh, enjoy the visual First, first impressions entering Jagdalpur, uh, I mean uh, this Chhattisgarh highway almost for around 100, 100 kilometers we are uh, travel we traveled only on the cement roads so the highway here is actually laid with cement uh, interesting fact uh, came to know from Vijayanna one of the co-riders so what he's saying is basically you know the contractors will not come that easy if there is any repairs or anything for the road and also uh, if it is a tar road, I think it is pretty much easy to pl plant a landmine uh, and uh, it will be not known as well. So that's what he told. Um, that is the reason they have gone for this area, particular area with, with the cement roads beyond 100 kilometers or uh, with one and a half hour of riding. We stopped for somewhere for uh, no break. Literally everyone's tire is smelling like anything, you know, they burnt. Whoa! So many soldiers just left right of me walking and uh, it is, it, there is nothing actually, there is almost forest area this side, that side and they are just walking uh, near these roads. So even they, they are actually uh, these, what, what do I say, L anti landmine vehicles. Whoa, crazy man, that vehicle is massive. Kachitanga Andhra test lete undo expect che maakande. Unna theyado unta We are in Sukma and uh, just finished our lunch in Sukma almost at one o'clock or something. So morning six we started and almost three hundred kilometers we did in uh, six hours or something. Uh, it's okay. Uh, we have uh, enough time to reach Jagdalpur before it becomes dark. So that's the agenda. So we're not riding so fast we are driving just carefully and uh, just keeping the cruise speeds at 100 yeah it, it was fun till here okay we are in the last uh, 40 kilometers or 35 kilometers stretch now we are entering guard section so i have uh, the rocket and then tiger traveling with me there are other folks who travel a little bit front but the good thing is guys i got this senna for this uh, ride and uh, when I was spending 30,000 on this, I was like uh, very much uh, uh, worried like I should, is it that worth? 
is it a uh, 30000 oh my god but the fun in this is different guys i will tell you the 400 km it's nothing i didn't even feel okay it's a bum make and the roads are not bad in the last 10 km that is fine but this is so crazy guys because like nine people we were just on and on in the conversation the jokes are cracking like anything you know and uh, we have this uh, jaggu anna who was joined in this ride the triumph 850 cx i guess so many jokes having fun and uh, you know with the right people i think uh, you can travel a little more i think even i can uh, do 500 plus per day okay so one thing is in the last 60 kilometers when you are coming from actually this route which are to jagdalpur you will definitely find uh, the particular uh, uh, what should i say the stretch is not so good potholes are like so so bad i have to slow down the bike everywhere because the interceptor suspension i don't know it is tuned a little bit on the softer side so when you hit a pothole you will feel the entire thing on the body my body is like vibrating like anything having fun himalayan two tigers having fun like anything they just cruising and uh, passing on the potholes so good to see them uh, right even Hi guys, good morning. So today is uh, Saturday and second day of the Chitrakot ride. Uh, today is the day actually we we visit the waterfalls and we have uh, came here to the hotel called Hotel Suri International. So this is pretty much decent hotel. So here are the staff uh, behind us. So I I should also introduce to you a very special person called Gupta ji. So he is Gupta ji and uh, he is the owner of the Gupta Travels. he is actually personally taking care of the entire trip over here so we are very much privileged sir thank you so much so yeah i will tell you the itinerary today today first we are going to visit tirthagar waterfalls and after the lunch we will be visiting uh, chitrakoot waterfalls so if we have any time left then we'll be try seeing maybe more places but i hope that's it two two places for the day and tomorrow when we are heading back so we may try to visit a uh, it's a national park like kind of safari over there so we'll try to visit that so yeah keep following me uh, in this video and please don't skip anywhere because you're going to miss some beautiful spots if you skip okay so see you at the waterfalls So guys, the park that you see here, uh, it's a Kengar Valley National Park. Just uh, opposite to Thidigar Waterfalls, it is there. Um, this is what I was saying before. So we are not going uh, to this now. Seeing here is basically uh, handicrafts and uh, woodcrafts that are made uh, in this uh, tribal by by the tribals of Bastar district. So where this Chakdalpur is, these are very very famous here and. can you guess they even get exported to the entire world okay guys so we have reached the uh, tirthagar waterfalls looks amazing beautiful just stunning i'll just show you the waterfall in a minute so you have some stairs over here that you need to you know uh, get down and then there is this waterfall is in like three steps so we are at the first step and uh, so this waterfall is actually formed because of an earthquake that happened long back and uh, you could see the waterfall i'll just show you very excited
सो गाइज वी आर फाइनली हियर एट चित्रकोट वाटरफॉल्स जगदलपुर एंड फील सो अमेजिंग बिहेंड मी द वाटरफॉल सो बिकॉज ऑफ द शेप दैट इट रिटेन्स इट्स ए हॉर्स टू शेप सो इट इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड इंडियन नायागारा वाटरफॉल्स सो एज दिस इज नॉट द परफेक्ट सीजन टू विजिट इट्स इट्स ऑलमोस्ट विंटर सो यू हैव ओनली वाटरफॉल टू ए जस्ट लिटिल एक्सटेंट Usually it will go all the way till there, uh, and at the time it will be really amazing. But even now it is really amazing. It's not having so much of height, but uh, the width of the waterfall is the biggest in India, in Asia I believe. So it's also biggest in Asia. So yeah, this place is pretty cool. Uh, you just need to pay some uh, entry fees for this, parking fees, and then you are in. Uh, my French has uh, gone down. Uh, to see if there is a boating facility actually there is a boating facility that will take you near to the waterfall uh, so they have gone down to check whether uh, the boating facility is there or not i am not planning to go for the boat ride as of now because i am pretty much tried for the last couple of days and uh, not 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 pretty much interested as well because it seems little bit risky so i am not doing it but if you want there is a option so let's quickly go down and see the view of the waterfall from down ओके चलो सो हियर यू ऑल्सो हैव रिसॉर्ट्स बिहेंड मी सो यू कैन इवन स्टे इन दीज रिसॉर्ट्स एंड वी अनफॉर्चुनेटली वी कूडेंट गेट रूम्स इन दिस रिसॉर्ट और एल्स यू विल गेट एक्चुअली व्यू ऑफ द वाटरफॉल डायरेक्टली फ्रॉम योर बालकनी यू नो दैट्स प्रेटी प्रेटी अमेजिंग एक्चुअली राइट सो यू जस्ट सी दे From this balcony, you can see the waterfall. Uh, we couldn't get the rooms because the rooms are very limited over here, and uh, it is all booked when we try to check. But you can definitely plan accordingly, and uh, you can book these resorts. Looks pretty cool. So you have this path, uh, which will take you all the way down. Uh, not near the waterfalls but to the base of the waterfalls so it's already pretty much dark over here it's uh, around 5 o'clock in the evening morning it became little late so we couldn't uh, reach over here pretty early but this time looks to be perfect okay guys so we have reached the down side of the waterfalls and you can see it is pretty amazing i'm i'm going to show you now Look at that. Look at that. Wait, I'll, I'll zoom in. That's amazing, right? It looks so good. I think in rainy season it will look more good. But still, uh, in rainy season it may be a little difficult to reach Jagdalpur as well because there is a 20-25 kilometers of forest stretch where the roads are not that much. Uh, in perfect condition i would say so yeah you pick a free time and then man i have no words just mm, just look at this guys all of my friends has uh, gone for boating so i i rather didn't want to do it but uh, if you wish to go uh, there is a boat over there i don't know if you can see it or not so, yeah. so you, you get the boat right all over here and then it goes to there and uh, it is it is definitely a different experience but i have uh, seen it in some other countries like argentina i have been there but uh, here <laughs> it didn't look promising so i didn't go but uh, rather i am enjoying uh, my time over here sitting just watching the waterfalls so overall it is a very good fantastic experience coming to jagdalpur both of the waterfalls has been so good um, maybe it's not the right season but yeah whenever we get the time we, we just keep traveling choosing diff some different place right so yep let's see how it goes tomorrow is a big day we have to travel another 450 kilometers back to home Um let's see how it goes
finally guys it's uh, time to head back to vijayawada i hope you guys enjoyed all the visuals that i am able to produce from chitragud waterfalls and uh, thirdgarh waterfalls it was a fantastic experience see the time was not permitted for us to look for more uh, or else uh, like i said there is a national park also i showed you right you can also visit that it's a time pass thing and also maybe if you are lucky you can find one or two animals also so i am lucky i found a deer wild deer actually it was uh, uh gone in the village and then villagers uh, trapped it and then brought it uh, to live back into forest so that is the visual you see it in the starting of the video so uh, overall the route to vijayawada to jagdalpur okay uh, 300 300 plus kilometers is fine lot 60 kilometers is not so good definitely because of this lot 60 kilometers definitely traveling in uh, rainy season is not that much recommended if you need any specific information or anything uh, specific about this uh, particular uh, you know jagdalpur chitragut etc you just let me know in the comments i'm uh, i will actually respond to any comment within like more, less than 1 hour uh, because i keep checking my youtube uh, notification section for any comments even on my uh, PPF video that uh, I sh- I I published and also even on the videos that I published for the cycle review and the camera shop there are lot of comments lot of questions I keep answering them whenever I have time like almost in one two hours so let me know in the comments if you are planning if you need any help with it let me know I'll try to even help uh, make some arrangements if you need so uh, yeah that's it so hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and. Uh, and i will see you in my next vlog you guys will see me in my next vlog <laughs>